Well, these are exciting times, my friends. If you log into The Simpsons Tapped Out today, you may well spot a little bit of a download going on, and that is because, if the rumours are true, the next level has arrived with new characters, new buildings, and um, new storylines for us to enjoy. So let's take a look um, at this little review of level 36. And here you are. Here, or here I am. Here we are. Here we all are. Let's try that again. <laughs> and here we are. Level up. Level 36. Obviously, that you'll only see this, of course, if you are already at level 35 and have built up enough XP over the last um, few weeks to hit this level. But assuming that you have, um, it's going to throw some lovely jubbly donuts at you. And if you collect them, you'll start to see some new stuff around. Now, the, uh, the quest itself for this new task is actually started by Nelson. So hopefully... Um, he will have finished a task, will be very close to finishing a task. And if you get him free, then that will start um, this new stuff off. And he says, um, I'm not sure I can do a Nelson impression on this particular one, but I'll give you a quick ha <laughs> ha. And then this starts off a nice dialogue between Nelson and Jimbo and Kearney, and eventually leads to the fact that they are missing Dolph, who of course is at the local video arcade playing The Simpsons Tapped Out or something similar like that. And that then leads us to our first building quest. So this building is going to set us back a cool $247,500, or to put it another way, it's going to be a quarter of a million dollars. Um, you got to, It's going to give us um, $200 every 12 hours, which I must admit isn't all that great, but it's a cool little design. It's nice to have a kind of um, a kind of an arcade thing, and of course, new characters are cool. Um, it's a non-premium character, but he does come with a 15-part. Um, quest line and thank you to uh, Topics for, for that information there. As you can see, unfortunately, I have um, spent quite a lot of money on, la on land recently, so I'm not going to be able to start this one off for a while, but it also comes with a Museum of Natural History, which every 24 hours will earn you $500 and 45 XP, which, as you can see, um, if I'm just going to show you, is, is a really pretty big um, building, but it's a lovely design. Um, I'm, I'm not going to get it yet, but um, as you can see, it is a really, really nice design um, you could have a lot of fun decorating because it's kind of the size of one of the manors and the schools, but it isn't an educational place. So perhaps rather than decorating this one with like um, slides and and uh, game stuff or decorating them kind of like posh statues and things, this is more likely to be kind of um, a kind of more public place, um, more perhaps in line with things like the the kind of the town hall and the library, um, which I definitely think could provide some nice opportunities for us to um, decorate it. Of course, it isn't only buildings which are new. If we head over into the premium section, we can get Jimbo for 120, and he is obviously a very popular character, been in The Simpsons right from the start. Um, one of the kind of the bully set, um, reasonably pricey for 120, has to be said for just a single character, and as always, a, a premium character will give you 50% more. But if you are a completist, you're going to get him, and then, of course, if you're a fan of that particular character, he's going to be one you are going to get. But wait, there's more! Um, we've also got a stolen bumper car, um, as in terms of uh, decoration, and if I kind of shove one down here out of the few pennies I have got, um, it's kind of like something that used to come out of Krusty Land, um, but it, it's a, to be honest, I'm not sure what I would really use this for in um, Springfield itself, I mean, I guess, I mean, it's the, I mean, it's called a stolen bumper car, so I guess the kind of idea is that um, it, um, someone has stolen it from Krusty Land and then kind of put it there. So it might be the kind of thing you might put in a kind of a junk junkyard section or maybe kind of stick in like a, a you know, near Cletus's farm as if it's kind of been put there with the kind of the piece of crap car and things like that. The ideal, of course, would be if the that, that kind of new decoration was actually able to be put into into Krusty Land and then you could actually kind of make yourself a, a bumper car out of them. But of course, it isn't here, which I think they're kind of missing a trick, really. And especially when I was discussing Krusty Land last week, one of the issues is, is they... They haven't continued to support Krusty Land with new decorations, and it's a real shame they haven't given us that decoration here, because you, you could easily kind of put together, using the fencing, a nice little bumper car um, uh, ride to go along with the rest of it. So there we go. That is um, a level 36. One free character um, and... 
building, one free decoration, one free premium character, and one premium building. Um, has to be said, it's not going to rock our worlds, but um, the two new characters in particular are uh, some classic characters that have been in the show for a long time and will certainly provide some um, entertainment for your Springfields. Um, once I get there, um, I will try and update you with the quests and stuff like that, but I hope you've enjoyed this little preview um, of level 36. Uh, take care, guys. Uh, if you've liked the video, please press the like button and subscribe if you haven't already. I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.